What's up you guys? Got a uh, another unboxing for you today. Um, this time it is uh, another Bluetooth speaker and this is a Winbridge model. Um, similar to the other one I unboxed but this one actually is bigger, louder and uh, has a few more features so really excited to get this one open. So I'll show you on the side right here. You've got the wireless headset with this one as well so you can talk through it. Um, it's got like karaoke, option, karaoke options loop playback um, looks like you can use like an SD card with music on it um, bigger battery hi-fi recording auxiliary inputs um, this one says it has an FM radio so that's pretty cool um, always a cool option you know in case your phone dies or you know your music just not working out so we got some stickers over here but no big deal let's go ahead and get it cut open now unlike last time where I took it out of the box and charged it up this is the first time I'm opening it. <clears throat> Oops. So, cool. Good packaging right off the bat. You got the little headset. I'll go ahead and take these things out too just to keep my small space here uh, organized. So right off the top, you've got the headset, you've got your user manual, and then we've got this little speaker. Alright, so let's clear that up. So, fill out, you got a auxiliary cable in case you're running something that doesn't have Bluetooth, like maybe an older computer or a CD player or something. You've got a micro USB, which looks like it would charge your uh, headset right here. So you've got a little charging brick. This one is a 2 amp charger, which is really cool. Most of these are like half an amp or 1 amp. And then we've got the speaker itself. Wow, this feels so good and like so sturdy and like well built. I guess, for lack of a better term. Oh, we got a peel. Oh, no sound, but still satisfying. So you've got some grippy feet at the bottom. Um, I don't know if you guys can see it on camera, but with the reflection of the sun and stuff, I can kind of see through the grill. So it looks like we've got one speaker and possibly a port or a tweeter over here. And your handle just kind of rest however you want it. It sits in back, sits up top, or it can go to the front. You can even like clip that to your bag or something. Bottom you got some grippy feet. Both sides there's really nothing. The back there's nothing but just a little uh, model sticker. And then the front and top. So you've got a microphone volume knob. That's going to be for this right here. Looks like this also has volume, but I'm not 100% sure. So probably like a manual override. Got an M for mode, left, play, pause, right, and looks like a record button. So you've got a headphone jack, you've got a microphone jack, and you've got an auxiliary jack. You've got a USB port, an SD card port. I don't have music on this, but just to show how it goes in. Super simple. And then you got a knob right here. Okay. Bluetooth is waiting for a connection. Cool. I like that. You got a digital vault. Whoops. So you turn it all the way to the left to turn it Bluetooth off. Bluetooth is waiting for a connection. Okay, let's try the microphone here. I'm going to turn it on. Okay, and it's already connected. It's already connected. I want to turn it away, but... Testing, testing, one, two, three. Hello, hello, hello. Well, yep, that gets plenty loud enough. Let me, uh, let me test the buttons on the microphone. 
Hello, hello. Hello. Yep. So cool. So the way the microphone works. UHF is disconnected. You've got a volume on here. This is just the voice volume. This doesn't, you know, control like the overall volume of the speaker. So you've got a volume here, and then you've also got a volume override here. So this is going to give you the whatever the maximum you have the mic set at. This will go to the maximum or minimum. So we're in Bluetooth mode. Let's uh, check it out on the computer here. Get some copyright free music. Okay, so right up here, um, you can't see it on my computer, but H5, we hit connect. Bluetooth is connected. And boom, is that simple. So it's got a pretty good sound. Um, again, it's not the most bass I've ever heard in a Bluetooth speaker, um, but for the price, I would be very happy with this. So let's try a mode. FM mode. Cool, so when you go to FM, there's actually a... The volume knob is pretty sensitive. But, so you just hold the skip button and it will change the frequency or you can press it and it's got presets. So, you know, you can preset your favorite stations and not have to scroll. Let's turn it back on. Bluetooth is FM mode. FM mode. UHF mode. UHF, so that's just the mic. The mic can actually, any mode you're in that I've seen so far, the mic will connect and speak over the music, you know, so if you're in Bluetooth and you connect, turn the mic on, it will speak over the music, you know, if you're in FM, turn the mic on, you can talk over the music. So you've got Bluetooth, you've got FM radio, you've got auxiliary, and just the straight up microphone. So the cool thing about Bluetooth mode in the microphone, if you want to just use the microphone, you can turn it on and in Bluetooth mode it'll still connect to the microphone. So right now we're in Bluetooth, I'll turn this on, and you can see we're connected. No noises, no uh, no noises, UHF no, is disconnected. no extra features, you know, nothing to change. I just, I had the volume all the way down up here so I had to turn it up a little bit, but I mean that's it. So you charge it right here with the micro USB input. So like I said, I'm glad they uh, went with micro USB on both the speaker and the headset. That's really cool. And this headset's cool too because it's extremely lightweight. I couldn't, I don't have a scale that would measure something so light. But I have a big head. It fits on my head. You can hold it and just talk like, you know, a, a game show host or something. Or you can literally put it around your neck like a, you know, a pair of like wireless headphones and just boom talk through it like that one more thing I almost missed so something really cool with the microphone like I said you can wear it on your head you can wear it around your neck or you can just hold it it really helps if you read these as much as we don't want to they come in really handy you can actually take this thing push up and now you've got just a little handheld mic if you got like a shirt with a like a breast pocket, you don't even need to wear it. You can just drop it right there and then boom, it's right there by your mouth. So, really, really cool feature. Tons of options. This thing feels nice and rugged. Now uh, let's go over some features. So, it is 9.8 inches, wi inches wide. 
9 inches tall, uh, just under 4 inches thick. It weighs just under 3.5 pounds. It is 30 watts. So this has two 1800 milliamp hour batteries in it to total 3600 milliamp hours. It says 5 to 6 hours of playtime, which I believe because their other speaker that I reviewed had just about what they estimated and I had it on pretty high volumes. So the headset has a 380 milliamp hour battery, which says to last about three hours. So, you know, if you're doing some kind of choir service or uh, something for a gym or, you know, a, a park service, anything like that where you need to speak for a while, you should easily get, you know, roughly three hours of, of talking time. And if you need more, you can always bring a little portable battery pack because these do charge with micro USB and get plenty more runtime out of them. And this is something too especially cool for right now with the times we're living in where you might have a crowd of people that you have to, you know, speak to louder. Something like this is awesome. You know, you could have somebody holding this up in the air or set it up on a shelf and be able to speak to a lot of people in a pretty big area completely wirelessly. You know, not have to plug anything into a wall. Boom, just all wireless. So the cool thing I'm seeing about this is like, if you were a person that hosted like parties at you know your local park or like arts and crafts type deals and you need some way to be louder and you don't want to break the bank and spend a bunch of money or need something that's like hardwired and you know requires you to plug in or is you know just there's also a lot of portable speakers that are just gigantic you know and you don't want to carry around something like that this is super lightweight like it's less than four pounds you can throw that on there Throw this on there like this, and then boom, you're ready to go. You got everything you need right here. And the cool thing is, with the USB port on there, I'm assuming you can charge your phone or the headset right off of this. So let me try. Plug the included USB cable in. Yep. So that's really cool. This thing doubles as a gigantic battery bank. So if you are using your mic and it goes dead, plug it in. Um, if you're playing music off your phone and it goes dead, plug it in. You're going to get a full charge out of your phone and still be able to play. Plus it looks really good too. You know, you get a lot of these cheaper speaker options in this price range. They just look like crap. You know, they just, they look really cheap. They feel cheap. They feel you just like hollow and plastic. Like this one, granted, it's made out of plastic but it just feels good. It's It's got a really good weight to it. You know, nothing's rattling around. The handle does move a little bit. That's what you hear kind of moving, but you know, you got a nice chrome knob. Really clicky buttons on the top. I like that. And everything's nice. It's just a good setup. Oh, that's something cool too. You can even uh, put the arm down, angle it up if you need to. You can just lay it flat on its back, however you gotta do it. And the nice grippy feet, that's uh, that comes in handy too. But I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this uh, little unboxing and review up. And I will link this product in the description below. I appreciate you guys watching. Um, let me know if you have any comments on it. And uh, yeah, have a good one guys.